Hey guys, welcome back 1776 or bust. So today is a question day for all of you. I decided to make this quick video. Last week's chat, I brought up a question about whether or not you think a lever action is better to own than let's say a bolt action rifle. So I'm going to kind of expand a little bit on that question and make it more of a general question on the, the, I guess you could say the expectations of what you see here, which is my Marlin 3030. Uh, this is a 336 stainless steel one of my newer additions to the collection but one of the things that i i would like to know from all of you is do these guns still have a valuable purpose now there are some people who are in the camp that these guns are still excellent firearms to own for the simple fact that you can use them for so many different uses uh home defense self-protection um hunting you name it so it has a variety of different calibers you can get these rifles in and at the end of the day you know there are people of this train of thought that say this gun is still worthwhile it is not irrelevant and it has not necessarily aged out of practicality there's also another camp though that says well let's be honest the more modern sporting rifles that you have now the semi-automatic rifle you have much much more capacity uh quicker shot acquisition quicker shooting uh the ability to shoot prone which somebody did mention on the chat so there obviously are a lot of the positives to the sporting platforms versus something like this However, it's not really a comparison. It's not saying, okay, if you had to pick, what would you pick? Would it be this or an AR? Uh, I think most people would probably pick a modern semi-automatic rifle as opposed to something like this. But the real question is, are these still valuable? Are they still valuable in the sense that they are still practical and they are still useful? You know, I do own several of these. I only, it's funny, I actually only own one bolt action rifle and uh, I never shoot it. I, I never do. I'd rather shoot something like this or one of my other rifles that I own. But at the same time, to me, they still have a purpose. They're still useful for many, many different applications, whether, again, like I said, home defense, self-defense, or hunting, uh, and, of course, target shooting. So to me, yes, it's not the most practical, and it is not the best modern rifle out there, but I still think that these uh, lever actions, no matter what brand you're tied to, no matter which ones you like, uh, they're still useful. Now, of course... When we talk about these older classic looking designs, we also have to bring in the more modern sleeker designs. So again, this is my dark series. You can see I have done some adjustments to this rifle, but at the same time, these kind of bring it into a more modern, more, I guess you can say, refreshed state. The idea that now you have a rifle that does look modern and sleek, or what we like to call tactical. Yes, it is a tactical looking rifle, but again, at the end of the day, it is still a lever action. Um, and in my opinion, very useful. And as you can see from the difference between the two of like this one here versus the stainless steel one, you're still getting quality quality equipment. More importantly, a quality round in the 3030, which again is not that bad. No, not the best ballistic uh, uh, speed and all that other stuff, but at the same time still packs quite a punch. Uh, and that's not including a 4570, but at this point, just a 3030. So I'd love to hear what you guys have to say. I want to know from you, the, the gun person, the average gun owner like myself, do you still find that these lever actions are worthwhile or do you think they've kind of aged out of practicality? So I'd love to hear what you have to say. Leave those comments down below. If you guys haven't subscribed, please subscribe, hit the notification buttons and also the thumbs up. I figured I'd say that at the end of my video because everybody else seems to be doing it also, but whatever. Um, so I hope you guys have a great day. Stay safe. And as always, freedom is never free.